This I believe. 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 I believe in my grandmother Lucy Wright. She was an amazing woman. Also very strong wielded, wise, straightforward, funny, and could curse like a racehorse. But some will say just a little crazy. I would say that's my grandma. My grandmother had a smile that can light up the whole entire room. I believe grandmothers were made to make you smile and laugh at sweet old memories. When life seemed so hard to bear, my grandmother would tell me to sit on the floor and talk to her. This poem by Barbara Cage makes me think about my grandmother. Love for a grandmother. She remembers all your accomplishments and forgets all your mistakes. She is someone that you can tell all your secrets and worries to. She hopes and prays that all your dreams come true. She always loves you no matter what. She sees all your past tantra tantrums and bad moods and makes it clear that that does not affect how precious you are to her. She is the person who encourages you and touches you tenderly. She has a full loving smile. She is one person in the world that will always be proud of you and who will always have you in her heart. She is the one person in the entire world who loves you no matter what, always in her heart. She remembers the child that you was and the fine adult that you are now by Barbara Cage. My grandmother told me that I can only trust God in her. I believe my grandmother had a lot to bear. She lost her husband by a heart attack. She lost both of her legs from diabetes and she also had a stroke. But she is the strongest woman I have ever met. She never lost faith in God or joy for life. She was a woman that feared no one but God. When I was little, some people picked on me. My grandmother told my grandmother told me that she wanted their names and addresses, like she was going to get out the bed and whoop their butts. But that was an effect. She said, "Never touch anyone. They will get what's coming to them." She was a very wise woman. She said that let them hit first. And then you finish them off. Even though she had no legs, she had the strength of 20 men. But she also had a mouth on her. Once, she almost made a grown man cry by cursing him out sitting in her bed. She was a strong spirited woman. I believe what she taught me will have me be so successful in my life of becoming a woman. When she passed away, I wasn't home. I cried until my heart hurt. It felt like someone was tearing it out with a knife and it just became a big black hole. The loss of my grandmother was terrible. It felt like my world was gonna end, but God had a plan. He had me to, okay. He had me to leave the house because if I was there, I would have probably lost it. I will never forget the value she taught me. I believe my grandmother is always watching over me, protecting me from all the dangers in the world. This I believe. She's smiling in heaven making God laugh. This I believe. 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 This I believe.